welcome back to another video. So today, out with my good buddy Josh, I have his channel linked down below. But we're trying to finish 2023 off strong. It is December 31st. We're trying to get some uh, marsh fishing in, trying to get on some big reds, trout, and even maybe, if we're lucky, some big snook. So uh, we're gonna go ahead and cruise through the normal marsh environments you guys see me fishing during winter time. We've had a pretty significant drop in water temperature and air temperature, so hopefully we can find some nice fish schooled up in some holes. But uh, I have a feeling it's gonna be a decent day, so uh, let's make it happen. Because I think we're, yeah, dude, they're reds. I just saw him pass by the road. Oh my God, no. Dude, he bent up my lure. That sucks. I was kind of joking about the fly rod, but I'm actually... Oh, yeah. I mean, got him. All right, y'all, first fish of the day and not a bad one. That was quick, guys. Literally my like third cast of the day. What I tell you, buddy? Yeah. Sounds good. Dude, he's really bigger than I expected. Oh my God, he's like, Ah, uh, I might. Dang. Beautiful colors too. Thanks, man. Thanks, I appreciate you. Oh. <laughs> you got the net. All right, y'all. My first official wintertime redfish. I mean, it's been a little cold the past month, but not like how it is this week, so. Pretty dope, you guys know, split tail finesser always gets it done. Tough conditions, cold conditions, hot conditions. There it is, purple nurple, split tail, right in the corner of the mouth, gotta love it. All right, y'all, first fish of the day, an absolute beautiful redfish to get the day started. I'm thinking he's about 24, 25, but awesome. Absolutely nailed it. I think we're about to get into him thick, so I'll go ahead and give him a nice little release, send him off on his way. Real healthy fish. Let's go. Oh, here we go. Oh, no. Darn. That wasn't bad at all. Yeah, so that would be an epic fly fishing day. Mm-hmm. Big neck. All right, y'all. Woo! He hammered that thing. It scared me. That's a trout? It's not bad. Cool beans. Might drop it on us here. All right, y'all. That's pretty cool. Been a little bit since our last fish because we ventured back probably a little too far. Definitely my fault. But <laughs> nice little trout smashed the purple nurple ultra paddler with uh, this chrome tail. Pretty cool little color I've been using lately. I'll pop it out with some pliers and show you guys. All right, y'all, there it is. There's the bait. Oh, fish on, guys. Immediate, as soon as I switched to the split tail finesser, in the uh, deadly dragon fruit color, I got bit. <sighs> All right, let's get you up here, buddy. A tiny red, but still cool. There it is. Dope. All right. Really? Oh, fish on, bro. What the hell? As soon as I was like, let's go. All right, y'all. 
What is that actually? Really? It looks weird. Oh, dude, it's a sand trout. It's a big sand trout and he swallowed it. Oh, shoot. That's crazy. Oh, never mind. It's a speck. He just, his, oh, yeah. his spots faded. Dude, it's a good fish. That's a nice fish. Here we go, guys. It's a great one. Same lure the redfish ate. Yeah. Nice. It's something though. Guy for a little bait. Yeah. Ultra paddler? Yep. Nice. Sweet. Gold member? Yes, sir. Nice. I feel like it's hard to beat little paddle tails when it is cold. Oh, yeah. Like, Everything eats it. Yeah. Like, you can throw a big one and probably catch a big trout or something, but. You're going to catch more throwing this. Yeah. Like, yeah, you're going to catch some smalls, but you catch some bigs too. I think it's worth. Yeah, he came right in the middle. You're, dude, you're slaying them with the Ultra Paddler, the mini one. That's awesome. They're in here. Maybe a little bit, a little bit better. Yeah, it's growing. Still, yeah. Still not huge, but a little bit better. You don't need my help, right? No. Okay. Yeah, he's a little bit better. Barely. At least they're getting bigger, though. You almost caught up to me now. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Got another one? Yep. Nice. I think we found the rat reds, but <laughs> hey. There's some bigger ones mixed in here, right? I think so. They're usually all pretty similar, but sometimes you can get it to where, like, while you're catching little ones, yeah. fire up a big one. They definitely want that thing moving, though. He didn't hit it until I moved the shrimp. I didn't even work that thing yet. What the heck? <sighs> yeah. All right, y'all. You guys haven't seen me use this in a while because it hasn't been cold enough, but this is, if I can get them to stop moving, I'll show you guys. This is the MS Hybrid. Super good for tough days. Nice. How we looking? Better one. Nice. Definitely a better one. Nice man. Putting that out or no? Oh, it's out here. Alright, how big can you make him look? <laughs> big as you need. Real quick. Sounds good. I can't believe he came back for it so many times. I know. Probably does. I bet you the further back you go, I mean, I'm sure there's some good sizes in here. Yeah. People, there's no way people go this far back in here. Dude! That's that was a bass. bass. That was a big bass. Yes, it was. It's a real big bass. It's the heaviest bass I think I've ever hooked. Uh -huh. That man was massive, dude. My God. Unless it was a red. Yeah, I think it really does cut it off perfectly. Yeah. Shit. That blows. No way. Better fish. Better red, dude. Yep. That's a nice red. You may do something? Sure. That was sick. He ate it right under the log. Yep. It's the biggest red of the day. Yep. Yeah, it's like the side. Dude, it's like the. You think? You think he's the same one? One I got on Wednesday. Maybe. He's the same exact colors. Dude, he is super gold. Yes, he is. 
You got to get a pick with that one. Oh, yeah. Oh, for sure, dude. Good. All right, you guys. It is cold today, and we are way, way back in here in the back country. Look at how golden orange this redfish is back here, way in the back. Smoke that 2.8 inch Ultra Paddler from Omen. I'll go ahead and link it so you guys can see it. But we're catching a bunch of reds back here, having a great day. So let's go ahead and get them released. Maybe. <laughs> Gorgeous, gorgeous fish. Good deal. Ooh. Nice man. Nice voice crack there. Ooh. Yep. I mean, we know nobody's fished back there before, you know what I mean? Yeah, sure. Got him. Oh, a bass. Is it a bass? Yeah, we got, we got a backwater slam, I think. Right? Oh, no, it's a red. What the heck? Really looked like one for a second. It's because it's so dark. Guys, let me tell you. These 2.8 Ultra Paddlers have been putting in absolute work today. Super stoked to see it. And make sure you guys check out the website. There's 20% off sale right now for everybody. So go ahead and go take advantage of that. Of that, I'd be more than happy to make you guys some awesome baits. Percent off on that. Oh, sorry, buddy. I was just holding them. Can I take them home with you? Yeah, put them in my pocket like my phone. All right, y'all, I've got to go ahead and head back to town because we have a New Year's Eve dinner thing tonight. But had a blast exploring these like crazy backwaters with my buddy Josh. I mean, the day did a complete 180. It started off super tough. Well, actually, it started off great like the first couple casts, and then it got tough, and then we figured out what the fish were doing. Lots and lots of like smaller redfish, but still super cool to get that many in one spot this far back into the uh, river systems. Um, and definitely some good ones also. Josh caught a really nice one, I caught a really nice one. So can't complain, always good to get consistent action. That is all I've got for you today. I hope you guys enjoyed it and I look forward to seeing you in the next one. Peace.